ended up competing my, with my dad, who's also an engineer, uh, mining, not petroleum. Uh, what has kept me in engineering, though, is probably the fact that it's just a very satisfying place to be. I mean, I love figuring out the puzzles that are going to improve my industry, my community, my culture, uh, my planet. I mean, a lot of the very things that oil and gas gets criticized for, our engineers are working to fix. My thesis was on making uh, heavy oil production a greener and more environmentally safe process. We are an industry that has ups and downs, and you have to be prepared for those downs. Um, but a well-rounded engineer is going to be wanted in a lot of places. I usually encourage people not to pursue petroleum engineering until they're graduate students. I actually suggest they do an undergraduate in mechanical, electrical, chemical, so they get that broad base of engineering and then get the specialized exposure of a graduate degree, a master's degree, PhD, or the like. Um, because that way, they're prepared for the downturns and have the flexibility to start looking at overlapping industries. And I think that's good both for them personally and good for them professionally because a lot of those ideas from refining, from agricultural, from electrical engineering, from computer science, now can sort of cross-pollinate and inspire the future of petroleum engineering as well. Oh.